So let's begin with some entertainment news across the world. But today's segment is more of who said what. So we'll be playing you videos of who said what. I hope you get it. Okay. So we'll start with the first one. It's an interesting one. And it says, I wish men were more in touch with their emotions and vulnerable. And that is from Beverly Naya, who is a British-born Nigerian actress. And during an interview, she said some things that she wished men would do often. Let's take a look at the video. It's like, I would, oh no, I wish men were just more in touch with their emotions, like women are, um, and vulnerable. Do you understand? Like, women appreciate that so much. One thing I know, one thing I've noticed is that when a man is able to be vulnerable with a woman and can't explain how or when it happened, he's in love with that woman, he's done. He's gone. Do you understand? Um, but I wish that men were able to just be more vulnerable more often without feeling judged for it or, you know, like embarrassed for being vulnerable. I feel like men, especially not even men in the, all over the world, but Nigerian men are conditioned to believe that vulnerability is, is, a, a, sign is a sign of weakness. And I don't agree with that. So I would love that to change. And I would love for men to just em embrace their vulnerable. It's like, so there you have it. That's Beverly Naya, and she is saying that she wish men will be more in touch with their emotions, and also they should look vulnerable. Because mm. if you are a man and you look vulnerable, if you are a man and you you are into your emotions, your partner values you a lot. Mm -hmm. So that's what Beverly Naya is saying. I don't know if Harriet agrees, but I'll take I don't I'll, agree, I'll but take her thoughts. <laughs> I'll take her thoughts. Well, I'm done with my entertainment stories. I can't let her cut in. She knows what she wants to say. Away from that, so can Paluta uh, always gives us some uh, melodic songs and some punchlines. He has a brand new song, and one of his songs he's advising us. So let's take a listen to this advice. <laughs> Street rap. Mm. Can Paluta? These your words. I don't know if it's an advice or he's just trying to make a statement. But then, oh, if, you mm. <laughs> it's nearly come for. if you check on Twitter, I mean, there are mixed reactions with regard to this particular lyrics. But anyways, I'll just leave you to judge and I'll take Harriet's thought. But now, away from that, my own Damini Obu Oluwa Ogunu, a.k.a. Berna Boy, has said something interesting. And Bernard Boy said, did I pull an omale on your girl? Because I can. So during a concert, Bernard Boy was interacting with the audience. And then he said something because we know what happened with, with regards to Omale's situation. Omale pulling somebody's girlfriend onto the stage, doing the whole silhouette thing. You get it? Yeah. So Bernard Boy is also asking that, did I pull an omale on your girl because... He is burn a boy and he can do that. <laughs> I said, are you ready to go home? <laughs> so tell me why these guys been looking at me like this the whole show. <laughs> huh? Did I put an anomaly on your game? Because I can. So start smiling more before you lose her. Okay, so that's Burner Boy asking the fans, not even necessarily only a fan, but then um, he was interacting with the people in front of like the stage. You know, when you go for a concert, normally people like to be in front, like myself. When Burner Boy was in Ghana 2022 for the Afro Chela, now Afro Future, I was closer to the stage, so I understand what he said. So he's asking that why is a particular gentleman there and he's not smiling? Why does he think that he's going to, he, Burner Boy, is going to pull an omale on the girl because he is Burner Boy and he can't do that? I don't know if it's a flex now or so something, but it's, it's interesting and it's funny. But anyway, our last story has to do with Kai Senat, who um, is in Nigeria. And we all know Kai is an American online streamer. He's a YouTuber who is getting so like so fans, so many fans and a lot of money on YouTube. And now, as I speak to you, he's in Nigeria and he's having a blast. And he met the man himself, David Doe. And David had some things to say, introduced him to his team, so on and so forth. So let's take a look at that video. Like this, the whole show. 
Yeah, yeah, peach, and I'll give you a 30 yeah, BGG. A 30 BGG? Yeah. Deal, 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 deal. Welcome, 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 welcome. Good? Yeah. That was good. Man. Yeah, it was good. I think uh, some, some more of the A and P fellas on the way, too. Yeah. Over here? It's my manager, Asa. How you What's doing, up? bro? Hi. Nice, nice, nice to meet you, boss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Lucas, come. Hey, Rich, come. Oh, yeah, I've seen him. Yeah, that's Logos. Yo! Yo man, what's what's up, up, Broski? Yes, whole, sir. Whole rider on unavailable. Okay, I'm unavailable. Oh, you saw of unavailable. Oh! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know what? Kai is so happy. I don't think he's going to go back to Atlanta. No, he's going to stay in Nigeria. No, he's going to stay in Africa. And on, on Twitter, X, people were actually asking that. If Kai is to come to Ghana, which of our, not artists, but which of our entertainers, who, or even an artist, can entertain him like how the Nigerians are doing? Shatawali. And I saw, <laughs> I saw three names. The first one was D Black. Mm -hmm. You know, D Black is the enjoyment minister. Yeah. So, I mean, D Black can do something. Mm -hmm. And then the second one was Shatawale, of course. Hands down, Shatawale, hands Shatawale. down, Shatawale. And then I saw Manikal's name in there. I was like, okay, mm -hmm. Shatawale okay. and Manikal are like so close. So, like, yeah. they can pull it up for us. Oh, like, you, you love Shatawale. I'm telling you, yeah, you love Shatawale. Shatawale yeah. is just a vibe. Yes. Aside, you know, attending shows, he's a vibe. Hey. I mean, Oh, you know, he, he, he signs and no, then he no, no. bills out he and he say that uh, there's some luxury, has luxury, luxury. No, he has repented. He, has he started repented. last year with Akawaganza. Okay. And this year, the opening ceremony yeah. for the 13th Olaf yeah. game. So Let, Let's hope that it continues yes. like okay. that. Okay. So, Harriet, your thoughts. Which one are you going to start with first? I wish <laughs> men were more in touch with their emotions and vulnerable. Ne men, please, never. Never and ever. See, there are certain things that, you know what, it cannot be changed. It will take a long while. Like, the way it took a long while for women to be able to vote, there's the same issue. Like, it will take a long while. Because, for men you know, to be vulnerable. Yes, for, 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 for the society to accept men to be vulnerable. Hey. I think they themselves should start. No. So that everyone me, I don't like a man who is vulnerable. Suit. No, because, no. you know, okay, society is cut in a way that men are supposed to be built hard, you're you know, so it, 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 uh -huh. Uh -huh. it's not even about the cry. You can't cry because mm -hmm. me, I can't stop myself from crying. Mm -hmm. You can cry and you shouldn't be so openly vocal about your emotions because wow. people will look down on you. People will treat you different. They'll even start calling you legit quiet. That's how I pronounce Legit it. what? Legit quiet. <laughs> <laughs> the rainbow people. They'll start <laughs> calling you there. See, please keep it to yourself or someone that you trust. You know, there are boys, boys that, you know, you, you vibe with them like that. You can open up to them. Or if your woman is understanding, or if your mama is understanding and you can go to her, but please don't be openly vulnerable. <laughs> they won't accept you. Legibit's it's quiet. Yes, Legibit's quiet. <laughs> Unfortunately, that's the case. We cannot do anything about it. Be strong. Sometimes they say you should, be, you should even be fearful and ugly. Can you imagine, like, as a man? All right, move to the next story. <laughs> but as for Kim Palut, I, honestly, I, I've listened to the song. I'm trying to find the advice in there. <laughs> for the first time, I don't like the lyrics of Kim Palut's song. It's too bad. It's too bad. It's too... It's, ah, Charlie. I want to say something, but... It's okay. You let and me, the song lyrics is bad. It's let not, me send some it's my words. It, it's, it's not advising anyone. <laughs> and Burner Boy, you know what? He can, he can. But you know, oh, there's something about Omale. You know what? Please, no artist should do that again. That The way that thing trended and the way the guy was feeling so miserable and all that, I think it should never happen again. Um, I mean, Kai Kai and Shatawale, I really want to see him with Shatawale. He's really going to enjoy Ghana. Ghana Plus, there's continue. unending, you know, electricity. Like, you can go <gasps> everywhere. You can have fun. <laughs> it's not going to be generated. Hey, they've started to do so, do so, please. Oh, but it's better. Don't let At least it doesn't there. last for 30, 30 minutes. Okay. Hey. hey, then my area is... They don't want to give us a schedule because they don't want to acknowledge that. It's actually so yesterday, do so. They said it's maintenance. It's, it's what? Maintenance. Do -so. It's maintenance, what? so yes. Don't let me say so. what happened to me last week Friday. We are sorry, ma. <laughs> so, that's my... Harry, my thank you very much for the... I, I love this in the 70s across the world, what people actually said.